New at four, one organization on a mission to help those in need says its donations are down significantly this holiday season. Action News Now reporter Christian Lopez is live at the Salvation Army in Chico. So Christian, what's the problem and how can people help? Well, Alan, for starters, they don't have enough bell ringers right now. Uh, right now, they only have about 20 people helping with their Red Kettle campaign. And that is down from about the usual 100 that they see throughout Butte County. Today, I talked to Lieutenant Jeff Boyd with the Salvation Army, who says that this is the lowest number of volunteers that they've seen so far. And fewer volunteers means less money coming in. Now, Boyd said last year they collected about $80,000. But so far this year, they've only collected about 6000 and that goes directly to affecting how many kids we can send to camp during the summer, uh, how many kids we can have at our summer camps here, how many seniors we can help, and we really serve the uh, at-risk youth and the, um, the vulnerable, the vulnerable here in Chico. And so every dollar that goes into the kettle is literally a dollar going straight back into the community. And so another thing you can do if you don't have time to volunteer is just put a dollar in the kettle when you see them by, and if you see the volunteer, you know, wish them a Merry Christmas. Boyd says the Red Kettle campaign starts during Thanksgiving and it runs through Christmas. They have them set up at places Tuesday through Saturday, places like Hobby Lobby, Walmart, Raley's, and on weekends, they're also at Made in Chico and Once Upon a Child. Now you can call the number on your screen to sign up as a volunteer, and we are going to share this number with you again before the next commercial break. And if you don't have enough time to volunteer, even just a small donation can really go a long way. And coming up at 5, I am going to be talking to a woman who says that the Salvation Army has really made an impact on her life. Reporting live in Chico, Christian Lopez, Action News Now coverage you can count on. Thank you, Christian. And Boyd says there are other locations available to them in Chico and Paradise, but not enough volunteers to set up kettles right now.